Pam here, your own personal fitness trainer. And today, we're gonna to be doing warm-up exercises. Yeah, the exercises you need to do before you actually do your workout. And in a moment, I'll share that with you. So, what are the benefits of a warm-up? Well, it improves your circulation and increases your blood flow. And warmed up muscles move faster than cold muscles. And it'll help prevent injury, makes you more pliable. And it actually improves coordination because it enhances your motor skills. Agility will be better. Overall performance will be better. So that's a good reason. And I'll start them now. Arm circles. This is going to enhance the mobility of your shoulders. And you notice my arms are out to the side and I'm doing very small little circles, but I'm gradually going to expand that circle, making them bigger and rolling them the whole way around. You can do that both forward and back if you like. But you wanna do it very gradually. Okay, this is shoulder circles and the benefit, it enhances the mobility of your shoulders. You notice I am rolling my shoulders in a backward motion. You can do that like 10 to 12 times. Okay, this one is called hand crossover. Uh, you might not be able to tell, but one hand is showing and then one palm is showing as you crisscross your arms. It doesn't matter which one. It's one hand and one palm and you slowly switch and cross your body. It improves the mobility of your shoulders. Lunch with diagonal reach, with or without a weight. And you notice I'm in a high five position. I lunge forward with my right leg and as I lunge, I rotate my torso to the right to reach across my body with my left arm, almost as if you're trying to put the dumbbell or your hand into your right pocket. And then I reverse that movement and this enhances the mobility of your hips and the chain of muscles between your hips and shoulders will function better together. This is low side to side lunge and you notice that I'm just shifting my weight back and forth as I clasp my hands in front of me. Enhances the mobility of your hips and helps you loosen the muscles of your glutes and your groin. All right, this one is a lunge with a side bend. And a step forward with my right leg and as I lunge, I reach over my head with my left arm as I bend and rotate my torso to the right. Showing you a back view there and that will loosen your thigh, hip, and your oblique muscles. Now I will say the lunges take a bit of practice. Knee hugs, loosens your glutes and hamstrings. So lift your left knee towards your chest, grasping it with both hands just below your kneecap. Then pull it as close to the middle of your chest as you can while you stand up tall. Ankle circles enhances the mobility of your ankles. So without moving your bent upper leg, rotate your ankle clockwise and counterclockwise. Walking high knees loosens your glutes and hams, so without changing your posture, raise your left knee as high as you can and step forward and repeat with your right leg. Walking high kicks loosens your glutes and hamstrings, so keeping your knees straight, kick your right knee up, reaching with your left arm out to meet it as you simultaneously take a step forward. Hamstring stretch. So with one leg bent, one leg straight with a flex foot, I lean into it with a straight back for a count of five second hold. Alternating, keep that back straight. 
And this will loosen the outside of your hips. Bent leg, take the one leg across top of the knee, sitting back, straight back, hold for a count of five. Showing you a back view there, so you can see my back is straight and I'm sitting back. This move will help improve your posture and it loosens everything for the upper body. So, you notice how my hands come together, I lift them up and now see the palms are up. As I pull my shoulders back slightly, palms up, turn them, bring them up, palms up, turn them around, up, bring them back together, and pull the shoulders back. And then finishing off with jumping jacks. And then on to my workout. So there you have it. Those are some warm-up exercises that I do, and I have tons more. So I'll have to do another video. And I did want to say thank you so much to all my subscribers out there. I am so happy to have you, and I'm meeting a lot of nice people on YouTube. And thank you. I do appreciate it, and I think you know that. So anyway, if you are new, join us here. I love to have you. Just click on that subscribe button there. And you could like it or share it with someone if you think it'll help them out my video or they'll enjoy it. So anyway, until next time, see ya.